Ah, oh, man, this is going to be awkward, isn't it? Episode 8 of Mob Psycho 100, The Older Brother Bows, Destructive Intent. The end of the last episode had Mob fighting his brother Ritsu, basically beginning his, his ultimate villain path, it seems. And honestly, it may end up being a good thing that he found him because he is at the very beginning of this journey, from what I can tell, aside from all the stuff with the student council president. But still, maybe he'll see Mob and it'll kind of like shell shock him into realizing he's going down a bad path. Be sure to drop a like on the video if you haven't already, and let's hop into this one. You also have the loose end of the, the guy in the hood that I think is also a psychic. Oh. He did see him again. Oh, he, Teru told Mob. I was wondering how he kind of just stumbled across him. Oh, man. God, that like, it's so, it, it's so creepy. And now he's gonna find out about Dimple too, I think. <laughs> now, why is Mob bowing is the question. Yeah, true. And there's the guy with the hood. Okay, I figured he would lie his way out of it. You're gonna leave? Really? This is tense, Teru. <gasps> oh. Oh. He still has Dimple, too. I wonder if Dimple affects his mind. I know it does, but how much does it? Is he gonna fight him? No, for real! Oh, he's dipping. Oh, no, it wasn't even Dimple affecting him. It's straight up, he's, he is drunk on power. Oh, my gosh, Ritsu! No. No! I thought it would snap him into place. No, he's right. I... Oh. Oh, he says his congratulations. Oh, no, this is sad. No, he's dead set on this path. Huh. She is so powerful. Well, that wasn't Mob's fault. Oh, that's not Mob's fault, though. I guess he was scared of what happened with those bullies, but... Delusional admiration. Oh! Wait, how can he tell? Mob's very surprisingly very calm. I guess he knows his brother better than us, but... There's something else. Dang, Mob! He's being the big brother. He's willing to for Ritsu. Because he sees this social, this popularity is important and he wants to save this for Ritsu. Or he wants to try to. Oh, he's probably talking to the guy with the jacket. This voice actor sounds very familiar. Bring him here? Sakurai? Mm. Is he looking for Mob or Ritsu? Oh, Ritsu. Wait. Oh, no. Wait. It was supposed to be Mob, though. Dang, that's clean! Oh, my God. There's something more about Mob that they're looking for, but since Ritsu pretended to be him, it's ruining whoever this is their plans. Ritsu just kind of seems embarrassed now. It's Mob. Oh. Is he just straight up gonna yoink him? Oh my gosh. I want to see this guy's face. Oh. Oh my! Yeah, exactly! It is kind of cute because they, they are middle scores. They aren't strong. But the thing is, Ritsu now is a psychic. Where's Mob? What is Mob doing? There he is! Oh, he's spiking! 
Yeah, the animation go hard. Mob spiked like 70. I mean, his brother's being kidnapped. Of course, it's gonna be like an emotional outburst. This guy's wasting time. Mob's gonna, mob's gonna pop. Brother, they are middle schoolers. I feel like Mob's just gonna be standing there. There he is. He's up. What percent? Oh my gosh! Oh shoot! He's got a giant scar on his face. <laughs> that animation was insane. Maybe this is gonna teach Ritsu a lesson. That there are powerful people out there and he needs to use this in the right way. You have, he's protecting his brother. Yeah, he has to use his power now. He didn't want to against Teru because it was it was himself. I wonder why he was covering his face. I mean, I guess I guess the scar. I don't know. I feel like it's gonna have something. Oh, that's cool. I feel like his appearance is gonna have some significance later. Like it's someone they know. Oh my god, it's weird seeing Mob getting beat down. Where's Ritsu? Wait, what if Ritsu like builds up that that emotion and has an explosion? Oh! Damn! This is what he wanted to be able to protect his brother. Not for him to have to stand up for him. Go, Ritsu! Oh no! You were supposed to hit him. I don't think they stand a chance. Is that? No, that's Mob. Mob still hasn't exploded. All right, well, I think this is going to be the first time we see it, like, actually... I don't know if I would say offensively, but he didn't want to... He used it inherently just defensively against Terror, whether he wanted to or not. He is strong enough. God, the shadows! Oh! Get into him, Bob! Oh, my gosh. This guy got sent on the wrong mission, bro. He's still trying to hit back. So Mob have like an inherent defense during this too. They doesn't even have to control. This animation is insane. Dog, this show is, is crazy. My God. It seems more in control than with the, the situation with Teru though. Like he's speaking, he feels more like Mob that time. He got up? Oh my god. Wait, Mob already exploded. Temple! Temple spectating. If I bring him here. Who are you going to bring, Temple Reagan? Okay, so he's not in like that dark form anymore, but he's still strong. They're all fanboying Mob now. He's gained the respect of all the gang leaders. YT Poison! Now they know. I like how him having the white shirt, like, uh, uh, confirmed it. He's gonna try and take Ritsu and run. Yeah, it's not like the shadowy mob. But it's still like, uh, it, it's still... It's like the mob versus Dimple. Wait, what? Sleeping spray! Oh, you are shameless. Wait, maybe he's gonna... He might take Mob now. Uh, what does he mean disappear? He's up! Oh, he admitted it. Yeah, he is gonna take Ritsu and run. Actual coward, man. Dog, Mob just saved all of them, but he couldn't save his brother. Is it Reagan? Oh, no, Teru. Oh, he went to get Teru. That makes way more sense. <laughs> I'm so glad we have Teru, though. I feel a lot better about Mob. It's like someone that understands Mob. Dude, that animation popped off. Says you! He's shredding the rock around her. This is annoying to spirits, bro. He's pulling at Ghostbusters. I hate this. I like to torture him. Yo, she liking this massage a little too much, brother. <laughs> it's a train. On a beauty trip. I mean, at least he's good at like having people relax and stuff. 
今回はガチなやつじゃなくて助けモブが約束の時間を無駄な Oh my gosh Bob usually is there to finish off the job Oh Reagan if only you knew why he wasn't there 何か悩みがあるなら言ってはいつでも相談に行くから I just one more I mean I guess I kind of understand why Ritsu went down this path but 何か悩んでたら相談乗るよ Bob was the older brother and he wanted to live up to the same expectations even if he was popular and the smart kid and everything Ritsu there's nothing he could do. He's like Deku in MHA when he, everybody else got quirks and he didn't. Mob never realized that he felt, uh, I guess, not good enough. Yo. It makes sense why he would think that at first. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I love his hair, dude. I can't get over it. It's so funny. That was a good question. Yeah, he's got a whole apartment. Stay away, bro. They took his brother. How do you tell him to stay away? Whoa. A hundred members in Claw? Oh my god. Manufacture. They make psychic powers. They're gonna brainwash Ritsu? I mean, Mob was trying to take him on, but barely. If they have hundreds, then they're gonna just destroy Ritsu. And what kind of older brother is Mob if he just sits by and does nothing? Thank goodness Dimple is here to tell us this. Tell them this. We already knew. Let's go, Dimple! Well, they're gonna go see and, and realize that everybody's gone, yeah. Or just destroyed. That's why they took all those kids. Oh, gosh. <laughs> this guy basically collected them all in one nice, convenient place for Claw to take them. Nah, he genuinely, like, cared about them, I think. It all makes sense now, yep. So they ended up winning in the end, or getting what they wanted. They just wanted Mob because he's an Esper, a young Esper. Not much at all. Like, they were all super minute. <laughs> Showing him how powerful they are, yeah. Is this a different intro or outro? Oh, hold up. More lore? They're just gonna show where they're taking Ritsu. And I feel like there's already evil in Ritsu's heart, which makes me worried that like brainwashing will just make it like 20 times worse. Like he wouldn't just be brainwashed, he would be like their best weapon. Whoa. They got a whole giant secret facility. Well, this episode just cracked this whole world right open. This this organization claw, I think, is going to be a very overarching enemy. I don't know if it's just this season or over the course of several seasons, but they seem like an in-game boss. I mean, this secret organization kidnapping kids, brainwashing them, making an army of, of espers. But then again, like I said, we the world was just cracked open. There could be other organizations, other giant entities looking to control espers and now that we know that they can manufacture them i mean it changes the whole game but we got a very good look as to mob's power level in comparison to like someone insanely strong or i guess a really strong adult with uh, psychic powers and how he really can only take them on in that like i unleashed explosion form which i feel like is bad that he has to get to that point to be able to take them on but like, i mean the guy even said like i i can't fight anymore i have to take this kid and run so maybe it's a good sign for us that mob does have what it takes it's just gonna take a lot more of him understanding himself but that's been it for episode eight of our mobs like 100 watch through drop a like if you haven't already and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace